guys and welcome back to another episode with your boy Blake Fit. Yeah. All right. So today we're gonna bring you our uh, breakfast of champions. As you can see right in front of you, those are all the ingredients you need. It doesn't have to be the exact same things in terms of the pepper and the salt, but you are gonna need those food products that I have uh, listed out there on the uh, cutting board. All right. So uh, first thing you gotta do is make sure you wash your potatoes. Uh, wash them nice and clean. If you got a little brush. Uh, you could go ahead and brush them underneath your sink to get whatever excess dirt is there. All right, so you wanna cut them in half. Once you cut them in half, you wanna slice them as thin as possible as you can, okay? Why? Because they cook a lot faster, okay? That's number one, and number two, it goes better within the sandwich, all right? So just remember that. Okay, next up is your, um, is your tomatoes and those are sun-dried tomatoes by the way so just make sure you cut those up nice and thin um, as well you can do them dice you can do them slice you can do them however you please um, and then next up one of my favorite foods to eat or fruits shall I say are plantains so yes we are mixing it up we have a little bit of fruit well tomatoes are fruit as well but we have some fruits going and then we, over there we have some vegetables so we're talking about your onions. Yes, make sure you peel them, you cut them, and then you slice them, all right? And you will see what we're gonna do with these um, towards the end, all right? Uh, make sure you get your onions, man. Super, super, super good for you, all right? Mm. Look at the board go, look at the board go. Slice and dice, slice and dice. All right, guys, remember, um, safety first. Always remember, um, you know, take it easy. There's no rush in anything that you do. Um, you try to go fast, you will cut your fingers. Um, you, well, you may cut your fingers. And so just go ahead and take it easy. All right, so next up, we wanna go ahead and put some extra light olive oil on a pan that's been waiting for us. So um, I always preheat my pans. Um, I don't know about you guys, but it's a good idea for you to do that. Um, that's an extra step that you should take. So go ahead and preheat your pans and just get it ready, all right? So notice how I'm putting the potatoes in there, okay? So what I'm doing here, this is called a pan fried, okay? This is a shallow, shallow, shallow amount of oil that I put in here, okay? It's not too much, as you can tell, the oil's not even covering the entire surface of the pan, all right? Okay, so how do you know when they're done? When they got those nice, beautiful brown colors on there, okay? Okay, so you wanna make sure it's as nice and brown, just looking like that, and you just do the same thing to the other side, okay? All right. Now, notice I'm taking my time to put these uh, plantains or plantenos in as my Hispanics would say, um, because you don't want the oil to just, you know, jump out the pan and burn you. Okay, I've had uh, quite a bit of experience with that, okay? Now, how do you know when those are done? Um, look at those, you know, nice and brown. That's what you need. Okay, so next up is the egg. Okay, be careful when you put the eggs in the pan, all right? This thing just go crazy for some reason, you know what I mean? Um, notice what I did there. Um, I put the egg in a separate bowl and then I put it in the oil. Okay. Uh, once the other side is brown, go ahead and flip it over. Mm -hmm. I like it nice and crunchy. That's how I like my egg. If you like it runny, that's perfectly fine as well. Okay. So the only thing, the only ingredients that I didn't have in this video was my uh, red wine vinegar. Okay. That's the only ingredients that I didn't have in this in this video. So instead, I I instead of in instead of that, I'm going to use some olive oil olive oil is perfectly fine just make sure you use like a, a tablespoon and a half or two tablespoons is fine to cook this down okay so you see my onions they going and all that with my uh, uh sun-dried tomatoes all righty now it's time for the grand finale now once your meal is done that's what it should look like okay that's what it should look like Ooh, see uh, Okay, so you want to go ahead and put your plantains down on the bread first. That's how I like to do it. However, you don't have to do everything I'm doing like for like exactly, but it will help you if you do. <laughs> okay, so boom, right on top of the plantains or plantanos, uh, we are going to put our, our uh, potatoes, our papas, <laughs> for all my Spanish people out there who's watching. And then you want to go ahead and put your onions and your sun-dried tomatoes, and then you go ahead and put a little dab of your um, ketchup and sriracha and voila there you go that's what you have right there baby you have you a breakfast of champions okay all right hope you guys enjoyed this video man watch me go ahead and take a bite into this breakfast of champion why because i'm a champion baby yeah so hope you go ahead and like rate subscribe come back to my channel and uh 
Ask me questions if you got questions, baby. I got answers. Peace.